Nicole Smith and Steve Kime from Blood and Iron Martial Arts. Today we're going to discuss and show you the importance of a proper long point. Proper long point is essential because not only is this the point where impact is delivered from a cut, it is also the terminus point for a thrust. Let's get started. If we examine long point as the point of impact of every cut we perform, you'll see that it exists in every of the four quadrants, whether it's from a descending cut or an ascending cut. At Blood and Iron, we refer to this as inverse long point. A really basic drill, I'll be performing four cuts, one from each quadrant, making sure that all of my cuts end in long point. From my wrath position, I perform my first cut, make sure I'm in a proper long point, then I perform my second descending cut, then I transition to an ascending cut, and then my second ascending cut, and then I cycle. One, two, three, four. When practicing solo, drills ending in proper long point are essential to develop proper structure. At all times, your wrists will be in a handshake style grip and should not cast or cant backwards into hammer grip. The former will eliminate all rotational power generated by the core, and the latter will rob you of much needed measure, often resulting in a missed cut, either on medium or against an opponent. Both are equally bad. This drill can be done with a Pell to practice your targeting, or with a training partner who will actively defend every incoming strike using proper guards and ensuring that their point is towards their opponent at all times. For thrusting long point, the same rules apply. When I have my thrust, if I cast my wrist and roll my shoulders forward, I might get a little extra reach, but my structure is completely compromised. A very simple solo drill is simply to begin in either plow position or albear position, and I bring my sword forward into long point, ensuring that at no time do my wrist cast or my shoulders roll forward. Any break in structure will make counters and manipulation of my sword much easier. One benefit to working with a partner is I can practice long point as a wedge variant drill. Coming into my long point, creating a wedge, making sure that my wrists are in the right position and my shoulders are back. Because I cast my wrists and roll everything forward, it makes it really easy for my partner to overpower me. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please like and subscribe. And as always, a big thank you to our Patreon supporters. Without you, this wouldn't be possible. If you enjoy the content we produce and want to join one of our live online classes, please click the link below. And if you'd like to join us in person, we're now accepting students at our Mid-Island location. Information posted below. And remember, if you don't put in the training, you won't get the results.